I am going to show you how to put um, text over a photo in Adobe Illustrator today. Like, let's say you wanted to create a mock-up. Um, we're going to use um, a specific photo today, for example. So let me get that in here. Um, actually, let's use... Let's use one of the mug photos. I like to use this a lot. So I just went and found my photo. I did a file place um, and I have my photo here. I'm going to click and drag so it places my photo onto my artboard. And then I want to center it. Um, and then I don't want it that big, so we're going to make it smaller. But, no, I do want it big. There we go. Maybe not even quite that big. Just enough for the top and bottom. And I'm going to center it. And then I like to draw clipping masks, so use your rectangle tool and draw your mask around just over the edge of the artboard. Select your background photo, select the rectangle you just drew, go up to Object, Clipping Mask, Make, and there we go. Okay, now we have our photo in here, but let's say that we want to add some text to this mug. Or maybe you design mugs and you have a specific mug you want to showcase. Anyway, let's add some text to this mug, and maybe even my logo. Yeah, let's start with my logo. Um, so I am going to bring up my library that has my logos, and I think I'm just going to click and drag it because I don't need it vector, so here's my logo, and I'm going to bring that down so it fits. Go. And then you can go to your text tool and click wherever you want to add your text. And let's just have some fun and do biz chicks rock. So there's my text. Now I can go up to the top of my toolbar here and under paragraph you can align center. And I have my nice bounding box, so I can click on the corner of that, hold the shift key down, and enlarge. And let's pick a fun font. I use my font menu that's up at the top of my um, workspace here. You can also go to Window, Type, Character. That will bring up your fonts over here, too. Um, let's try... I want something kind of fun. Maybe that. Yeah, let's do that. And then. Just like that. And if you wanted to recolor it, you can go up here to your color palette and pick a color. But my branding is black and white, so we're going to do keep it black. So, what you want to do first is go ahead and do a save this, or save, um, and you want to keep it in Adobe Illustrator format, um, so it'll have the .ai extension, and you can go ahead and do that. And then when, so let's say you wanted to use this on Instagram, or upload it to your website, or any digital space, it's not going to take an Illustrator file, so we have to export it to get a JPEG or a PNG. So you can just go to File. Export, and you can do either one of these, export for screens or export as, we'll just use export as, and then I'm just going to put this on the desktop because it's a test, and down here is where you can pick your file type, there's lots of different ones, um, social media, either a JPEG or a PNG is the best, and then... You just hit export, 
And if you're doing it for social media or a website or anywhere on screen, keep this at RGB or select RGB. Quality, keep it up to the, to the top at 10. Um, compression, I always leave it at baseline standard. Resolution, um, you don't need high, you only need screen resolution if you're doing this for social media. If you were gonna print this, if you were gonna send this off and have it printed someplace, like old school on a press, um, then you would want to do high 300, but we're not, so just do screen, hit okay.